Wicked right. is uh, the newest novella in my Wicked Lover series. I've been um, really looking forward to writing about Jesse, who is a character I introduced back in book two, Decadent. And I was waiting for him to sort of, you know, mature and ripen like a fine wine. Um, he had a lot of growing up to do, so I was looking forward to kind of letting him percolate in the background and figuring out who he was uh, as he grew up, um, kind of in the limelight, but then, um, you know, realizing that he needed to have a personal life beyond stardom and all the things that came with it. So it was great to see him mature and come into his own and find somebody who kind of really balanced him. Uh, actually, the thing that inspired me to start the series was a friend I had uh, years and years ago, and he was a very good friend of mine, and unfortunately, he passed away. And it was one of the mm -hmm. things that um, he, he was so impactful in my life in some ways, and he really um, inspired, just a good friend, and he was really inspiring. Uh, he was a good old Cajun boy, nicest guy you'd ever want to know. Um, had lots of secrets and interesting sides. So uh, it was sort of a tribute when somebody sent me a picture and it reminded me of him in certain ways. And the whole thing just percolated in my head. And I was really happy when the idea hit me. I was, um, it, it was the right idea at the right time. And it was kind of a tribute to me, from me to him, um, even though he couldn't be with us anymore. Mm -hmm. Um, what I'll say is they're written in such a way that what you have is a series of continuing characters so that, for instance, if you picked up in the middle of the series, you might not know the past characters I'm talking about, but you'll absolutely be able to story the fo the, follow the story I'm telling you right now. So uh, with Pure Wicked, for instance, even if you hadn't read the book where I introduced Jesse you would still be able to follow along and understand. I'm, I'm going to give you enough background in order to yeah. figure out, you know, who he is and where he's come from and how we got to this place. So absolutely, um, it's, it's kind of more fun in some ways if you can follow along book by book because you'll understand yeah. the supporting cast completely. But other than that, yeah, you could, they're, they're standalone enough that you could jump in the middle and have fun. Uh, you know what? I think in some ways that I really enjoyed writing Bristol, Jesse's heroine, largely because yeah. she she's kind of every girl who's ever been jilted by a guy who um you know is is kind of standing there like wondering what happened what went wrong you know and then having to especially living in a small town where then you have to be you see these people constantly and uh, there's yeah. no getting around it and there's no getting away from them. And, you know, it's it's kind of that always in your face thing. 